Welcome back to another video on the channel and today I'm going to be showing you how you can really easily hide icons and files on your desktop. So as you can see I have all of these different files and folders just like um, cluttered on my desktop and I'm going to show you how you can make your desktop go from looking like this to this. I just want to emphasize that this method does not delete any of your files, it just simply hides them temporarily. Alright, so how exactly do we hide our files? What we want to do is open up the terminal. So to open up this application, either go to the search bar or you can just command space. And in the search bar, you want to type in terminal. The terminal is a place where you can write simple lines of code to create files manually and edit parts of your interface. To hide our files, we're going to have to write two simple lines of code, and I've copy-pasted those two lines in the description below. So you can go ahead and copy-paste them into your terminal. But the first line of code is this one. It's defaults write com.apple.finder create desktop false. This doesn't make any sense, but trust me, it works. What's important is that you have this false at the end. You need to make sure that you have false after this uh, line of code and this will allow you to hide your desktop. So once you've written this line of code, just press return and you'll notice that nothing has really hidden. That's because we have to still refresh our desktop. So to refresh our desktop, just type in kill all finder. And then as soon as you press enter, you'll see that all of the icons and files and folders that were previously on our desktop are now hidden. Now the applications in the dock down here are still available. So if you want to access the files on your desktop, you can go to Finder and Desktop and all the files should still be here. But as you can see, there is no files or folders available here on the desktop. Now how do we get our files back? It's actually the same thing, except we just have to change one word. So open up your terminal and you're going to want to write this exact same line of code except change this last word to true. So I have exact same line of code and I'm just going to change false to true. And again, we have to refresh our desktop. So just type in kill all finder. And voila, all the files and folders that were previously on your desktop should come back. So a quick recap, just go into your terminal and write this first line of code with false at the end and then refresh your desktop with kill all finder. And then to get your files from hidden to viewable, write that same first line of code except change the false to true and again refresh your desktop using kill all finder. Alright, that's it for today's tutorial. Thank you so much for sticking all the way to the end. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe, and if there's any specific videos you'd like to see in the future, make sure to leave it down in the comments below. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.